Hey yo, and welcome to Callum Does the Internet. Right, it's a slightly more serious video today. Um, I'm going to be conducting an investigation. I've been made aware of a video on, um, I don't know if it's about me, but I'm most certainly being talked about in it, apparently. Uh, big shout out to the lads in the group chat um, who made me aware of it. It's Lou Hart, it's Verstappen fan, it's the Impressionist, Garol, um, TGT, yeah. Well done, lads. Um, they've done well here. Uh, they will literally watch anything on YouTube, I guess. So they've been watching a Jack Manifold video, who has apparently been... Well, they say he's been bad-mouthing me, which I'll be surprised about, to be honest with you, because I have got history with this lad. Um, a while back, his mate, Tommy Innit, was attempting to biff with me. Now, I silenced him very quickly and luckily for him. He came... I don't know if he knows how close he came. He was within an inch of his life. Or being distracted by me. I've literally got a video on my channel, just not live. Tommy in a diss track. Um, never made it live because I couldn't get it mixed and edited to my liking. Uh, also, I was very fat at that time due to the lockdown weight. Um, and he was only 16. I didn't want to bring his mum into it. I, I gave him a stay of execution, but um, I remember back then Jack Manifold was attempting to back his little Minecraft body. So he's always been on my radar. Uh, so we will give this a watch and an investigation. Now, he's with one of his friends, apparently, I'm guessing, another Minecrafter, another Minecraft body, Jush, Jushlat, I think it is. I don't know how you pronounce his name. Um, but apparently, it's, well, it's called Ranking the Best of British Memes. Um, I'm not, I'm not a meme. Technically, you are incorrect there. Um, people, I mean, I've made content for years now, seven, eight years. People have tried to make me into a meme. Uh, but I am not a meme, so you're factually incorrect at the, out, you know, at the outset of the video, but it's okay. Um, I'm not going to judge them too harshly on that. I know the way the title game works on YouTube and stuff. Um, and if it's respectful, then I'll, I'll give them credit and I'll, you know, no further action will be taken. Right, let's give this a watch, shall we? Shlatt, you've laughed at me many times for being British, for being British, and that's, I think it's okay Why to be British. Why would you laugh at that? What are you doing? <laughs> What are you doing? Uh, oh, sorry, I was just using my uh, perfect teeth. Uh, yeah, uh, of course it's okay to be British, especially if that's the alternative. I'm like you, you stupid British person. Look at my- Yeah, look at that, you're scaring me. No. You're scaring right, I don't like this slack person. I mean, first off, your name sounds like the cross between a promiscuous woman and someone clearing their throat, mate. Second of all, pipe down about British people, you Yankee Doodle dickhead. Me. I they look that. beautiful, and even so, you couldn't even chew through that mint without being in agonizing pain. Fine, I'll do it I'm again. I'm not going to come out on top in the conversation about tea. Are you good? So keep quiet here. Oh, what are we doing today? I'm going to try and yeah, win you over, right? And tell you that Britain isn't too bad. So I've collected the best of British memes. The funniest wow. things coming out of the UK. So memes from British people or memes about British people? So here's the thing. I said to someone, hey, find me the funniest British memes. And yeah. you have just said that, and I went, I never specified to them which. So I think <gasps> we're about to find out. <laughs> Why is that so funny? Okay, I get it. We get it. We get the premise. You're crapping out a Reddit video, aren't you? You're performing the equivalent of a biological evacuation in video form. It's fine. I'm going to film a Reddit video later this week. You know, I'm trying to do second channel videos and stuff. Just be honest about it. You're crapping out a set like a, a reaction video, a Reddit video. That's what's happening here. It's the best of British memes. Um, they're ranking them. Let's see where I rank. Let's find me in it, shall we? Oh, I live team. in a shithole. Birmingham is a fucking shithole. I hate the fucking place. <laughs> I fucking hate it. It's full of dickheads. I fucking hate it. He's so right, too. He yeah, he is. He is right there, to be fair to Danny. Yeah, he, I mean, he's worked on. We all get very angry at times, don't we? I've been there. Um, I've been to Birmingham many times. And yeah, it, it really is a hole. It's not a pleasant place to be. Right, come on, let's find me. Oh, this is, this is, I'm skimming through trying to find me. This is that um, prefect guy. Do you remember him? Four of you go! Like it's one, two, three, move! No. No. Like it's one, no. like three. Go. Go. Oh, three. Oh, my God. No. Yeah, he'd really lost his head, didn't he, that little prefect guy? I'd forgotten about that. That must have been back in about 2016. I wonder what he's doing now. This is quite interesting, actually. It's not a bad idea. I'm, I'm going to create a post on my Reddit, and you guys can contribute, like, best British memes. We're filming a video about it. It's actually quite a good idea. And maybe best rages as well. I do love a good rage. We've all been there. We've all lost our head. 
um, I do like to kind of rate it, I'm kind of like a rage connoisseur. I'm going to create a couple of Reddit posts, I'll leave a description in the video. I think I finally found it. A uh, couple of things before I start watching this. Uh, I had noticed, um, you've been dishonest, haven't you Jackie, this video? Um, the thumbnail, your hair, is a different colour to it is now. It's changed colour and you've got these weird little matching ear muffs to match your fill folding locks. Um, so that's dishonest. You've been editing an AI in, haven't you? Changing photo editing. Or it's not even the right thumbnail. You've just cheated. That's dishonest, isn't it? Also, you're losing your accent, mate. Um, there's some kind of twang there. I don't know whether you've moved over to America. I'm sorry for you if you have. Um, but you're losing your accent. Uh, just something to be aware of. Now, it's happening to me in terms of my northern accent. I am losing it. Um, but I'm not replacing it with an American accent. Um, something's going on there, just something to be aware of. All right, let's watch this. Oh, you surely Here's know this guy. I have, man. You can just tell when someone's British just because they mean? look. Well, bear with me. He just looks a little fucked. He looks a little uh, fucked up. No, right, okay, fine. Glad we're going to appearance. You look like slat. You look like you've bloody been boiling up a potion of moonshine out the back. You know, going round Prohibition with your bloody beard up in the mountains, boiling up a load of moonshine, drinking as much as you can so you're wasted enough that you don't realise that it's a, a bear that you're forcing to have boom boom with you. Unbelievable. Straight to appearance. Jack Manifold, you look like a water vault with Phil Foden's haircut. There we go, if that's the way we're going. On call four. All right, what would you say is wrong with this guy? He just got to look to Nothing's him. Maybe his head shape. It's the same way I can look at you and say, that is a British person. I... Without a shadow of a doubt, you are British. No, man. Nah, he just doesn't like the British, does he? Slats. Don't know what your problem is, sunshine. But I honestly, people in glass houses and all of that, you look like an literal Duke of Hazard. And I, 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 yes. I have, you know, the amount of times I've been asked if I'm Eastern European, just walking the streets, and then I talk in my British accent, and they go, oh, never mind. No, man, you, you are British. You're British. All right. And so is this guy. Yeah, and you know it's funny it. that you call out his appearance because that's what this whole video is about. Really? For he yes. believes his head does not look like a sodding tic tac. Yes, right. Number one, it doesn't look like a tic tac. Number two, in hindsight, I'm not proud of this video. It was as like a mistake, tactically speaking. I was internet naive. Um, I had a tiny little Facebook page. You know, must be less than 200 followers, just 10, 20 people watching my videos, learning from the teachings and stuff. It was lovely. And then this group of teenagers found it. Must have been six formers or something, or idiots at university, uni lights. Found it and started calling me a tic tac. Um, in hindsight, knowing what I do now about the internet, I wouldn't have made this video. Obviously, it made the situation worse. What I should have done is tracked him down individually and wreaked my revenge on a personal level without taking it online and making everyone else aware of it. But we all make mistakes. I, 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 now I know a lot more about the internet. I've learned and I've, I've gained knowledge from it. But yes, that is what this video was about. Um, and I wouldn't have made it if I knew not what I know now. Oh. <laughs> a final warning. Okay. Hey up and welcome to Callum. Hey up. Hey up. That's my thing. He stole my. He did yeah. my thing uh, before I did. Uh, I've had to say this a few times. Uh, he's wound that back in there. Luckily for him, very bloody quickly. Rewind. Error. Jack. Uh, well, it's not your thing, is it? You said it yourself. He did it before me. So you copied my thing, haven't you? You've tried to steal it. It's fine. It's a lovely greeting from the north of England. Everyone can use it, but don't try and claim it for yourself when it's not yours. And certainly don't try and let Tommy in it say it. Times now, but this is the final time that I will say this. Shut up about my head. <laughs> it is normal. It is a nice head. It is <laughs> not. It is a nice head. Tick. And I don't think you know who you're dealing with here. Look how tall I am. <laughs> Just no, nothing to compare. No it. reference, yeah. Right <laughs> well, now, there is a reference, actually. There is something to compare it to. You're assuming the same ignorance from everyone else. Maybe some people actually know the standard height of a UK ceiling and they're not downright ignorant like you guys, delighting in your lack of knowledge. You ever think about that? Doubt it. <laughs> just, just no way of knowing. Six foot five. Look at me. I'm like a beast. What is he? What did he just? He beat his chest like a gorilla to show, you know, his immense strength. He also flexed very briefly, but then kind of like sees it himself and yeah. goes ooh and he, stops. Ooh. <laughs> ooh? Do you, do you think I'm doing ooh like I, what? Am I 
perverting on myself. Ooh, won't get my muscles. No, I moved on because I've made my point. It was done. Idiots. <laughs> Idiots, all of you, the people who are mocking me. And I swear there's ginger people trying to mock me. <laughs> That's so great! Rose barely got a fucking strand of hair on his head. Who was he to talk you know, about that? I'm not. No, actually, I had quite a lot of hair there. That's longer than I tend to like to get it. Uh, and there was plenty of strands on there. It's just really short for self defense purposes. You with all your hippity hipster mountain boy hair coming off your face and your head. I don't know what's under that hat. I'd imagine poofy hair. Loads of it. Self defense situation. Someone grabs that, grapples you. You. It's game over, mate. Can't be done on me. Always get my hair short for self-defence purposes. It's a lesson for you. Learn from it. The kind of person you want to be messing with. I don't like cats. I don't <laughs> think kittens and puppy dogs are cute. In fact, I think all cats are dickheads, if I'm honest with you. Well, that's true. Most people think that cats are cute. Not this guy. Mm. That shows he's got murderous intent. Now, sure. Yeah, now we know he's a threat. I'm not cooing over them. I run out there and... Ah! No. No, I mean, I mean, I'm going to clarify that. There's nothing to do with murderous intent. I am not a psychopath. I was not murdering cats. I was keeping. I was an enthusiastic animal keeper. Guinea pigs, rabbits and stuff. Cats and nature's, well, guinea pigs, natural enemy. Rabbits, natural enemy. You know, they scare them. So I scared the cats, got them out of my garden. It's inherently selfish to have a pet that you let go in someone else's garden. Scare their pets and poop everywhere. I do actually own a cat now. I had to take it away from my mother because she was not... She's not qualified to look after a pet. She can barely look after herself. And I quite like this little cat. But you know what? When it's outside, it's on a harness in her ease. Um, she looks really cute in it, actually. But I don't let her interfere with other people. So I've softened my stance on cats. I do like them now. I've come to respect her hunting instincts and stuff. Uh, but I do it in a responsible way. A lot of cat owners could learn from me. Scare them away. So you want to think carefully before you start mocking my head again, because I'm taking names down. And I will show you list. all in a video. I will. I you wouldn't be saying this list. if you were standing in front of me. You'd be all towering. Times. You know, when I eat peanut M and M's, I crush each one in my fingers. So I'm strong. Do you know it's what I mean? Worker. You need to stop this stupidity, or there will be consequences. Mm. Names are taken and you will be shamed in a video. That's all I've got to say about that. That's it. This is what I love, right? Let me give you the context here. The reason he kept getting called a Tic Tac was because a guy known as Afghan Dan okay. made a diss track oh, about him. Lore. He got dissed on? He got no. dissed. And that's where this comes from. Oh. No, you're absolutely, absolutely um, incorrect there, Jack Manifold. That's not what happened is, oh, I made a video in response to people calling me a Tic Tac, invading my Facebook page and calling me a Tic Tac. For some reason, as soon as I uploaded this video, like, thousands of people started somehow seeing it and watching it. I still don't understand it myself. I had a tiny little page, some people called me a Tic Tac. I made a simple response video for them. Um, within three days, it had millions of views. Like, uni lads, lads, lads were putting it up on their pages and stuff like that. Then, William Lenny got involved he was like made a, a commentary video a video like this i guess like a reaction reacting reactor fun video um and for some reason afghan dan was like oh yeah i'll have a bit of that and he put out a tweet he's like if he gets 200 likes or something 250 retweets or whatever these cretinous things do i'm gonna send for tic tac this was a young blackpool chav who had never spoken to didn't even know who he was just suddenly threatening to diss me it was a ridiculous situation, and his diss track was awful. It was incredibly repetitive and really boring. Um, that's what happened. You're totally misinformed. Hey, this is the death. <laughs> <laughs> Missed entirely. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I've never noticed that. Tic Tac better get back in his box. Tic Tac better be getting off back to his box. If not, Mr. Tic Tac, get, get, get back in his box. You're kind of getting the point probably already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What was it? Yeah, I mean, if you haven't got the point, you're probably not going to get the point because that is the rest of the song. Tic Tac get to get back in his box. And the irony was, did you see Afghan Dan said? He looks just like a Tic Tac. Maybe even more than me. Tic Tac with hair or whatever. Tic Tac in a hat. It was ridiculous. The whole situation was just dripping with irony. 
Unbelievable. What's he doing? Was he acting out of line? I, I don't know why he did this. No. Why did he why did he make that district? I wish I him? knew, but I Cut. never learned the reason. Cut. But this is the thing, right? Uh. Afghan Dan made this. No one's heard of Afghan Dan in seven years. No, he's I a recently trip, he found a video of Afghan Dan. Like a current one? Like a current video. This is Afghan Dan today. I'm in court for burglaries and frauds. Burglaries and fraud. <laughs> How did this man call another man Tic Tac? Look at his head! Oh, no, you're right! Look oh at his head! Oh my god, you're right! You're he right. saw the hair, and he's oh, more Tic Tac shaped than Callum! That is more Tic Tac. Yes. Look at it! This isn't fair! Look! That's, a bloody That's not fair. Like Afghan that. Dan had absolutely yeah, no... He was, he was throwing stones from a glass house. Yes! <laughs> absolutely! What else we got? Oh, no. I don't want to watch anymore. That's enough for me. Thank you, though, lads. Absolutely, that's what I was saying all those years ago, and there he was jumping round my screen like a hyperactive little prawn, dancing round all tic tac. Better get back in the box, look in the bloody mirror. I, I wish him no ill will. I hope it did well for him that track, and it's sad that he, you know, with the prison stuff, and I hope he's okay. But just you know, a little bit of self awareness. Well, bloody done, lads. You were absolutely you redeemed yourself there. I mean, you weren't in danger of a diss track or anything. It was just a gimpy little reaction video. But yep, your knowledge there has redeemed you. And I've given you knowledge as well. I've taught you what actually happened. It's been a lesson for you. School's been in session. You've learnt um, and you understood the irony of it, which I appreciate. Thank you. Okay, we will leave it there. Well done, Jack. Well done, Schlatt. I don't still have that name, Schlatt. And sort your views out with British people as well. But well done at the end there. Um, massive thank you to all of you for watching if you have made it this far uh, if you enjoyed the video we can leave a like if you didn't enjoy it leave a dislike i will leave the link to the reddit down below um and you can pop your best british memes in for me to have a watch of them